This is where he has chin line. Look at that. It was known as the Chinese Potato King, Chen Lan, born in 1906, was one of the most successful farmers in the Sacramento St. Joaquin Delta area. Chen Lan arrived in the United States as a teenager and made a fortune until the alien land laws forced him to sell his land in 1920s, but that's in was in Chinese one for it. You you know that if you ever want to speak Chinese in the Mocha Museum, but it's like that. You know. Here it is, John Charlie Chinaman. It was in 19th century. It is just John and Charlie Chinaman, but. Charlie and Chinaman. Here he is, John and Charlie Chinaman. Also, here was one that Dr. Faith Sai Solong. It was that she's graduating from the College of Physicians and Surgeons in San Francisco in 1905. Faith Solong, born 1880 became the first Chinese woman dentist in America and only female member of San Francisco Chinese Dental Club. There's a one. Also this Feng Chou Guan. Oh, that was me, that. Also known as the Feng Wu. In, it was in the 1909. Also is Tom Gunn. That he born in 1890 was in the first Chinese American to earn in a U.S. Palat license. This is Tom Gunn. Here is this one guy, Joseph L. Pierce. Um, what we have this one? I'll give you closer. This is uh, here. He 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 is Liu Tingong. Liu Tingong. That's when you get his 1880. That he was born in 1858. Developed in orange that was both sweet and cross resistant in the land, Florida. The rarity, now known as Val Valencia, was awarded the Civil Wilder Medal by the American Programming Society in 1911. I'm going to give you this one. Can you give me the rest of those one for it? Here it is. I'm just, uh, yep, that's the one. This is the. Uh, I was one. This is where it goes. It is the. You can see the design. Soup plate custom made in China for New York State Governor DeWitt Clinton. It was the courtesy of the New York Historical Society. This is what it is. That's in Chinese one. Go east, go west. Yeah. My dad was moving to Guangdong because of that. But anyway, this is what it is. Blue under glaze canton for porcelain, porcelain beer stand. That's in Guangdong. And a teapot with garden berry knob. It's like this. So as usually, my dad was went to Guangzhou, and um, this is the history we went in China. One of the most historical of the great. Here's what we got here: the Great American Tea Company. Also got here, Pride of China, for D H Hoteling and Company, with the importer of teas, 39 Broadway, N Y. Here's one. We got more of that. Also got here. This is what we get. American Progress. Well, there's one there. If you 
I can also use to speak in Putonghua, that's in Mandarin. That's the Chinese Revolution. Here's one now. <coughs> in this one here. Canadian Pacific Ocean Service is limited. Pacific Service. Oh, wow. Move to the east to the and west. That That's another point. Um, but in the end, a lot of the Chinese immigrants were the ones who were doing the hard work. Oh. Mm -hmm. and here it is. We get. This is why we talk about this. And you know this. Why you ever use it in 1909? Uh, what else we got here? Shanghai, Shenzhen, and, and what's this one? It's this one here. Chinese minor scales used for weighting gold. You came here for courtesy of Idaho State Historical Society. Here should look like this one. Um, here from the class. It comes from the 18th or 19th to 20th century. Here's the book about draw water on these shaving. Is there any insurance? The, the policy ran out last week. Will we work? I got Chinese. What do you say about it? Who says about it? Yeah, it's a lot about how Chinese immigrants were... If we, if we like come to 10 oh, yeah. in a street at 7.30 Monday evening and express your option on the Chinese question. Yeah, and so this is a sign for xenophobia Chinese. for people who are anti-Chinese during this period. In 1892, in the late 1800s. July 23rd, 1892. Mm -hmm. A poster advisory a meeting to remove the Chinese from the city of Tacoma, Washington. Washington State Historical Society, Tacoma. They exploit their labor and when they started to organize, then American citizens began to become dismissive. Oh. The Chinese question turned into a violent movement. Burnings, expulsions, and lynchings were common. In 1882, the Chinese Exclusion Act was passed by Congress and signed into law by President Chester A. Arthur. This was the first time a whole people were fired as a race from entering America. The law left loopholes for merchants, students, and diplomats. Good Chinamen deemed worthy to enter, but honest peasants considered the backbone of Chinese society were treated as dangerous rats threatening the virtuous republic. And resistance, the Chinese American community really used the American court system to challenge each injustice. Such human rights cases continue to be cited in American constitutional law. So they really paved the way for what's even going on now, right? That's the when Chinese question. When it comes to like DACA and oh, yeah. all the dreamers who were welcomed into our country and what Trump is trying to do when it comes to barring them and excluding them. Oh, yeah. So the Chinese Americans uh, of the U.S. before set a really strong precedent by fighting for their right to be uh, here. Uh, fake news. Yeah, it's really important, exactly. That was President Chester A. Arthur says. Yeah. This is the Chinese are a source of danger to American civilization. Brief for debate on current political, economic, and social topics in 1908. This is the Angel Islands are right behind. I'm going to show you the Chinese symbols. It is Here, weird. here's what you have, this one. Gather together to say no to a group. Absolutely. It's not normal. And no, there's this one, other, another one. Right over here, I will give you a, a close look. That's in Chinese. Like writing in Chinese traditions, even simplifying.
Those who are exempted from exclusion, permitted to enter, had to carry identification papers and had no freedom to come and go as they wished. They could settle in their families. The law drew a new color line across America's democracy. Aliens ineligible for citizenship. Excluded laborers were sentenced to a life of separation from their families in China. Their wives could not enter. In addition, anti-miscegenation laws, which essentially means that if you are two people from different races or from yeah. different groups, you couldn't get married. Make interracial marriage illegal. Together, these laws created a bachelor society. The Chinese American family continued to be a rare sight in America until the 1960s. That's a really long time. Oh ah, yes. Because the Chinese Exclusion Act was back in the 1800s. Right? Wow. wow. Yeah. So that's long. over a century. A ah, long time. It's a long time. Remember those hats? Here's, here is what it is for a hat for in faint, made by Louis Xi, Louis Xi, courtesy of the Wang family mocha collection. Louis Xi, it was in 1920 for this hat. Well, I'll show you these wagons. Are what we call this one man manufacturer manufactured. Wow. What we call this it is the laundry press early nineteen hundreds. <coughs> this press or box mango was used by a Chinese paper. owned laundry business to smooth out large piece of clothing and alternatively to the laborers ironing proce process as seen in the ad ever advertisement below Randall's the company that created catered specifically to Chinese merchants Advisement from the Chinese Students Monthly, Volume 16, June 1921. It should look like this one, manufactured. Oh, paper. Paper. Okay, paper. You make your papers. Is that what that does? Like this iron that is going to called the way of a day's work. This iron represents the way of laundry work known by the Chinese community as the right pound. Li livelihood. Recently, one laundry closing its store in the 1980s. Museum staff noticed deeply worn and eroded floor boards where where workers where workers had stood six days a week, 20 hours a day. It says to please touch. This iron, you iron close after it get wet for it, like that. Here, wow. here's more of the laundry designs. Yes, yeah, like like hand irons, like that. Excluded from entering this country, Chinese can enter the service trades, including trading or capital. On this one, you can see the. You know, my it's really dark here. It says Chinese hand laundry. On that way. But it's all right to having having a really dark sign. On this book, if we know about this one, this is the picture inside the book. It's called the Toy Peddler. Toy 
toy, the toy peddler, San Francisco Chinatown. It was the photographer. I know. Jeff. I know Jeff. Donated in memory, memory of Fo and Edna Chen, Mocha collection. This is that old Chinatown. That's the picture. A book, a picture by I know Jen with test by Will Awin. First published in 1908 by I know I know Jen Jen 1912. The sign in the background: Chinese candles, five CTS period per, per bag, has been replaced with Chinese. Characters to give the impression that this stand was more foreign and Chinese than it was. Here it is, right? You were in the Chinatown, Chinatown, Chinese Museum, the classic poster. Well, that you went to the classic cinematic in the Hollywood that you were always want to know for it in has what an amazing emperor behind the scenes martial arts even Bruce Lee Chop Soy and then you Ever wine this one, these Chinese restaurant. House of Chan. Red lights got really on my cam. Port after Chinese restaurant. Here or oh here how to please your husband. Also got the art and secret of Chinese cookery. What we call this it is the legend of La Choi. How you can cook Chinese food. Chinese food chop soy. That's what we call it for it. The legend of La Choi. They used to call me the Chinese Sammy Davis. I say, no, no, you got it wrong. The guy said, what do you mean? I said, why don't you call Sammy Davis the black Larry Long? Larry Long, China Doll, MC and dancer. She is. Tom Ball presents Made in China. It was about, you know, in Shanghai, lady artist, Zhou Xuan. And then you use Beijing Opera. Then one, Chop Shui Circuit. This is what it is for it. It is for during the 1930s. Which means the rising spirit. Gong Hei Fa Choi, that was about the new, new, new Year, Chinese New Year. That were. Year, those 12 animals. This is the. That's called the New Year. One. Our day today life. Dragon dances. You say it says to press button for for auto. What I call it? Hmm. And they use here this mask of the dragon dance. Feed me your lunar New Year wishes.
on this one for it. If we said like Jung Long Lai Ya Shu Yi Chang Shu Yuan Ting Go Shan I speak about him in Putuha. Here here's the one T line New York Lounge. There's one for it. One of the classical Here, here the Chinese instruments, libraries, also this one. The Chinese National Party of Portland, Oregon, USA. I can hear that when they speak in Chinese. Here it is, Chinese stamps with the Chinese symbols. got inside the post office. This is a book about what we call a bachelor family album from the over history of Longchen, New York City. Mocha collection. Longchen. It was 1988. Guangdong that we uh here's what we got in this can. And that one. And uh, you know lots of people went to Guangdong having the Chinese culture, tea party, even the one of the most all uh, culinary This is, is, it's called like Meidong Hua Jiao Qinan. And, what well, this one here? It's, it's kind of, but that's another teapot. When you used to have drinking tea, while you have like, Red tea, green tea, black tea, whatever tea you want for it. Even like jasmine tea that I went for it before. This is the what kind of tea it usually for. It has to steep in and brew it with hot water. After the water is, comes to a boil. What that is, used for the tea factory, Chinese tea factory in Guangdong. It's called like the moon reflected in the pool at Iquan. Studying how to use for the tea party. Here in Taiwan, there was an, a capital in Taipei. Right you have for it? New nation. Do you want to look under the guys? Guys, look up over here. Uh, right behind. Okay. Yeah, I'm here. Okay, right. do it. You do, okay. Over here. How to tell Jap from the Chinese. Angry, synthesized, victimized allies with emotional outbursts and enemy. You ever know what you can do to do. Here, China. First to fight. United Chinese Relief. Participating in National War Fund. Also, here is the book about the Good Earth. It was the. It was written by Plur S. Buck. <coughs> A beautiful, beautiful book. Saturday review. It was. It was published by Pocket. It is Chinese first to fight United China relief poster, 1941 to 1946. Allies, with this one. This man is your friend. He fights for freedom. Here, on a Life magazine, here's the what was it? Got it. A Chinese dollar for that. Taiwan flag. Oh yes. Army soldiers with that. What do you notice here? 
well, you could actually have a this parade. They are most popular American dreaming. Here's that chi Chinese and America. Well, that that you know, it's kind about in, if you read about Mao Zedong, even Deng Xiaoping, with the Chinese president Xi Jinping, Mao Zedong, Hu Jintao, whatever, like that. This here's where he had this. It's time to change before it's too late. Beware of commuters in the United States. What this one here? A Chinese classical television program. Well, that here, you know, there's one old oh, new whatever the chairs so has. I forgot to tell you something about this. Mi Jiu Tong in Guajia. Oh, I got forgotten one of the New York. No, 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 Eve. That was before this of the dragon. Who does classical Chinese record? Having, having the musicals, but it says music from a grain of sand. Music for the struggle by. Asian in America that was in 1972 released in 1973 it's for the artist Chris it Chris Lin Chris Lin the, the book called Miela Project and Charlie Chin hmm, yeah, that's my, my word music inspired by Yellow Pearl soundtrack the documentary A Song for Ourselves 2009 that was that was about this. Yellow plural. When I asked what the early moment was like, my mom simply played an old record for me. That was about Tadashi Nakamari says. Here he is, Mao Zedong on the Like magazine. Oh yeah. Here is Deng Xiaoping came to visit America. Here is the pen collection. Like reading about the wave of change, gay insurgents. That's the critical war chronic. Here, this is what it says, which is means like we are one. Local 23 to 25, unite 100 years. Sewing machine that was. <laughs> Woman sewing in Gorman factory on Canal Street, and it was in 1984. Now we can move on to here for. Chen Guoyan, Vincent Chin. He is the Chinese American man named Vincent Chen was barely beaten to death in Detroit by two white former auto workers, Rano Ebnan and Michael Nitz. This is this here. See what it says for it, Xin Kong Jian, which translates to new spaces. Now, this picture of case study, Montreal Park, California. Now, that's what it is. Now, this is this is another one, Sunset Park, Brooklyn, New York. Now I'm in New York. Oh shit, boy. 
Yeah, William. Will you put a cap for you? Walk-in bowl. On the t-shirt. There's... Uh, uh, hold up. Set for it. I, anyway, you see, this is the con Constitution. And uh, mo model, model, mon modernity. You know, when you every time watching watching the Chinese the Chinese film before about better luck tomorrow, the you know in September eleventh, two thousand one, got they uh, they hit by a twin tower. That was that was real disaster. Here's what I read about this. A journey of a thousand Li begins with a single step. We got more of this. Stephen Ch Stephen Chan. Jerry Yan, Michelle Kwan. I almost forgot to tell you what who the Chinese American. Here, here, Yo Yo Ma. Yeah. Ang Lee, he was the Chinese director. Bruce Lee, he was martial art. A Chinese American for the first lady, Elaine Chow. Chow Sol. So scientist David Ho. And we gotta tell you, I forgot here. Also, Wang Weiwei, Wei, Wei Wang, and and also Hong Kong American Michael Wang, Wang Minda. Here's that. We got this. The last Chinese newspapers, Chinese newspapers. Also, this is called doctor's office and social center. When you for example, when you when you not feeling well, when you, when I get when I get fever six, you can you can you can go to the doctors, have have some pain pills. Even like here's what it is called China Doctor of J Day. John Day. Um, where we got this, the splendid in charge. Cop job. Like, when you have something, you spread it. When your drugs can make you feel better. That's uh, that's where John did. Shelf of Kamwa Chang and Co. General Store in 
I'm going to carry in John Day, Oregon. With this kind in the milk car. This is where he is. It was for Dorothy F. N. Kai Bio and Digital Mint Award. Season Pursing each other, the indescribable crowd is gathered. It was written that was Walt Whiteman. Leaves of Grass, 1855. For here, we can give you a review of the slideshows for the Dorothy and Kaibo. We have more of this Chinese medicine in America. Body parts. Oh, hold on. If every Chinese people are having a sick problem, like when you got not feeling good, you should go to the medical office in the pharmacy. Herbal medicine. Ginseng. Like, you had to drink tea while it would make you feel better, but now on. That's what I read about the New York Times article. Pins that you poke all the way through your body. And right here, or it, that's where the sounds. What that happened is this pin. They pulse on the body. It was the satisfied with the modification with those pins. It's really shot that you want to be careful to get the blocks drips over while leaks. Also, this one here. And I think, oh, we have more of that. And that's what we call for the Chinese medicine and Chinese medicine in America. And we want to say goodnight to the Mocha, and if you're interested when you're going to the Chinese Museum, Chinese American Museum, let me know in the comments below. And then hit thumbs up and then don't forget to subscribe. And then I hope you enjoy the day for the Chinese American Museum.